Hey folks, I'm Eddie and welcome to my channel. I have Huawei Band 8 in front of me and in this video I'm going to show you how to set it up. Now the first thing I want you to do is to actually charge it, charge it at least for 30 minutes before you do anything and the reason why is because if the battery dies in the process of setting up this can actually damage the device. So charge it for at least 30 minutes and then once you do that you can unplug it, you're going to see this screen here, the next step is to choose the language so i'm going to choose english here if you choose the wrong language don't worry you can just swipe down tap here and choose the language again so the next thing you need to do here is to install the app so let's do that next take the notes and here you're going to find the qr code so take your phone open the qr code scanner If you don't have this app, then go to the App Store, search for the QR code scanner and you can install it there. Once you open the app, you can scan the code with it and then you're going to tap on this URL here. Okay, so once you tap on the URL, you should be able to see this page here. If you don't see this page, you're probably going to be on another page where you have an option to tap on the app you'll see this icon here to install it so tap there and you should see this page here once you come to this page tap on install next i agree now here we have an option to log in with our huawei id um, so we can access the cloud app gallery and more we don't want it so tap here on back and I'm not going to use App Gallery, I'm going to download via browser. So tap on that. Tap on continue here. Hello. Now you'll tap here on download anyway, and you don't have to worry about this message. This is just um, how the browser works. So there is nothing wrong with this file. Tap on download, then on open. Then for the security, your phone is not allowed to install. So I'm going to go to the settings. And here I need to allow the installation, then go back and then install. So depending on the phone you're using, this procedure can be slightly different, but it should be relatively the same. Okay, now that the app is installed, tap on open. Next, I agree. And here it is. Here is the app. So the next thing we need to do is to connect our device to the app. So tap here on the devices and add device. Hello. And now the phone is going to scan for the devices. We have the device here. It should be close to the phone. Okay, so here it says that some features of Huawei Health rely on HMS Core to work properly. Download and install HMS Core. I'm going to tap on install. And this is again nothing to be worried about. I know that this is a little bit strange because most of the apps you'll probably install through the, your app installer. But this is slightly different, but it's really the same thing. So let's tap on install here. Installed. Done. All right, now I can link it properly. I'm going to tap here on link. Okay, so it looks like I need to create a profile here because I'm getting this pop-up constantly. So I'm going to actually register here just to go through all of this quickly. I'm going to agree. This doesn't matter. Tap on next. Here it says I can register with email address or with the phone number so i'm going to use my phone number here okay so the first thing you need to do is to change the country and then enter your phone number here once you run tap on next now we need to complete the verification i need to tap on these icons here so this is number one number two is this one and number three is this one now we need to wait for the message with the verification code and this is the message. Now tap on the next again. So the next step is to set your password. So here you are going to set the password 
and here you're going to repeat that same password and then tap on finish okay tap on yes this is really up to you if you want to tap some emergency contact i'm going to tap on skip here now i'm going to tap here on agree let's go back to devices add device sorry about that so we had to make that profile i just couldn't find a way to remove that pop-up here it is tap on link keep your device close to the phone now tap on hello hello and now on your smartwatch you're going to have here option to confirm it tap on check and now we'll have to wait a little bit and then you can see the pairing is done successfully you will see the watch face and with this we are pretty much done here you have two options you can check them if you like this is for auto update i'm going to skip that and tap on done now here we have an option to enable the device to automatically install updates definitely you want to enable that so tap on enable and now we are redirected to the notifications page um, so here you have few apps which are set up to send you notification from your phone to uh, the fitness band it's up to you you can disable them or enable whichever apps you want here and tap on done tap on okay here you have to allow this for the notifications again allow all of this tap here on okay and that's pretty much it i'm sorry guys for such a long and um, i don't know how to call it review it it was a little bit hectic uh it's just the way that they set up things here and um, i had to go through all of those steps i hope that this video was useful to you thank you guys for watching as always if you have any questions please leave them in the comment box below again thanks for watching have a nice day see you in the next one